Greetings and welcome everyone to a brand new let's play of um, Sonic before the sequel. So this is a fan game that was uh, created by Lake Fapard, uh, who also went about with making uh, the sequel, which is Sonic after the sequel. And correct me if I'm wrong, but I think he also made Spark the Electric Jester. I could be wrong on that, but we're just going to assume he has. Why not? Um, but yeah, this is Sonic before the sequel. Honestly, my thoughts on it, this is possibly one of my most favorite fan games to play, honestly. It's really good. It has really good, like, unique levels. And the cutscenes are like really like good at least for you know being fan made and everything so yeah so yeah um so that's uh that, that's up there yeah so we're gonna start this let's, let's do this dance and yeah So, uh, yeah, this is Sonic after, the, this is Sonic before the sequel, like I said, this is one of my most favorite fan games out there, and, uh, it's actually not bad, I recommend people who haven't played this to play it, it's actually not bad at all, and I want to give props to Lake Fapard for adding really, uh, for actually making this unique. I know a lot of fan games out there mostly use like Green Hill Zone for a lot of first time levels. But no, um Lake for Part actually used like his own unique level, which is actually pretty cool. I actually like it. Not to mention, uh, for people who wanna know, uh I had to go about with trying to fix encoding problems for this uh for OBS. Um, I think I may have fixed it because I don't see the error. Uh, for people who don't, uh, people who, you know, see it, or people who, you know, want to know if, uh, the video is good or not, please tell me. Well, not no, but I can't talk today. <laughs> please tell me if the video quality is good because I don't know. I feel it may not be good, you know, so, yeah. Um, but yeah. Also, gotta give props to the people who made the music too. Like Sonic after uh, Sonic before the before and after the sequel of music is really good, and I gotta give props for them. Uh, so yeah, there's actually a certain music I actually do love the most by the, by far. Like you know, yeah. Are we gonna see it? Are we gonna hear it? Who knows? I'm actually gonna put my sound up a bit high because I can hear the music and everything. But I I do hope you guys are um, enjoying these, uh, enjoying the videos and everything. Like I said, I'm gonna try and uh, record more. Ah crap! And my fan is on the entire time. I love it. Okay. Uh, if you may hear static, that was my fan. I forgot to turn it off before recording. I'm sorry if I do have it on, though. If people don't know, it is, like, really hot where I live. I think it's around summer where I live. So, I had to really put on the fan to get some air in, you know? Because I, I sweat a lot when I'm recording. People don't know that, you know? So, I do apologize if you guys, you know, see that... Or hear static in the background or whatever. It's just because of my fan, you know? Because it's really hot. So yeah, so forgive me for that, you know? But, yeah. Um, I also got a lot of things to talk about, like, for instance, I can't even fucking record Sonic Adventure DX. Go figure. The one time where I tried to, I can't even fucking re-redo the damn LP. I don't know why. 
Every time I try to record, it would always like dip in frames, like lag. Yeah. Like the frame rate would just drop all of a sudden. I don't know why, but <gasps> I am such a fucking idiot. Oh my god. Okay. Oh, okay, that was kind of cool. I was not expecting to do that, but yeah. Uh, <clears throat> so that whole re, uh, that re let's play of uh, a revisit of Sonic Adventure DX might not happen because of the uh, game record because of the game how bullshit it is. So yeah, yeah. Just. Yeah, I don't know. So I've been quiet there. I just, you know. Uh. Uh, my plan was I was gonna re- I was gonna try and record Stardew Valley, but that ha- But, uh, of course, the fucking encoding happened, so I decided not- So I decided to delete that video. Uh. A whole- I decided to delete it, and I didn't bother with it. So, yeah. Cause the quad, because obviously the frame would look like ass if I even fucking try and upload that shit. Well, just set radio. I'll probably have to do some editing now, cause uh, it was really getting annoying. It was not. It was hard for me to even record too, cause like, <clears throat> or even play the game. Cause having to worry about the encoding and then also have to worry about the game, it was like really fucking irritating, you know. So yeah, I don't know. It's just annoying, and that was the most smoothest fucking jump in the damn uh, special stage ring I've ever done in my life. But yeah, um, I do hope that I can literally not have to, you know, worry about bullshit. You know, I don't know. Oh shit. I don't know the point of these special stages. I don't even think you get a chaos more than me, so I don't know. I could be wrong. I doubt that the creator of this game is probably watching, but if Lake Fafar it is watching. Are there chaos symbols in this game? I I saw in a cutscene you get chaos I saw the cutscene that Sonic had chaos symbols, so I don't know if there's chaos symbols in this. Yeah, I just want to know. Yeah, I'm just cautious, or not cautious. I'm curious. Jesus, mage. Warning. Do you know it? <laughs> um. Ah, crap. Not cool. Not cool at all. That was not cool. I could have gotten two hundred rings. Oh, we got a cutscene too. Interesting. I like it's literally just Sonic CD sprite though. This music is so good. Just saying. And it's sad because this is the easiest boss to fight, and he has like the most badass music. I mean, if you slow down, you can literally just keep listening to it, but you know. We gotta continue, so. Oh, wow, that was not fun. Oh my god. Oh my god, I'm not even, do I'm not even trying to do that on purpose. I'm literally trying to hit Eggman. Alright, here we go. Oh god. Came here in a tire, lovely. There we go. Boom! Did it. Yeah. And we got through the boss act. Yeah. Haha. <laughs> yeah, that was awesome. Huh. 
Again, this is literally animation from Sonic CD. I think that's even the, the music from Sonic CD too, so... I don't know. Also, I, I, I also want to comment on this. I literally looked back at like the videos I did and the gameplays I did. And I totally forgot I did a video where I was like literally doing a rant about IGN and GameScoop. To where they, uh... To where they, uh, whatchamacallit, fucking, uh, shitted on Sonic, the new, uh, well, shitted on Sonic Mania and all that crap. And, like, I don't know. When I, when I made that video, I was, I don't know why, when I made that video, I was just, I don't know. I don't know. I just felt it was kind of necessary to do a video on it, or what better way? It'd be funny to like at least do like a Sonic gameplay while also talking about it. But yeah, you know, but that's a good reason why I did that. And holy shit, tails, you're high. If you look at his eyes, his eyes is really. I think it's dilated. Yeah, his eyes were dilated. I like that. <laughs> Showed that he was high. Off his ass. Um, but yeah. But yeah, that that's a really reason. That's another reason why I really wanted to do it because I thought that it'd have been like I don't know, fitting doing a Sonic CD gameplay while also talking about what IGN did. I mean, I don't know. And I actually did re like I don't know. I did re watch that video. Not the IGN scoop video, not my video, and I don't know. I didn't tele, I didn't telegraph, I didn't telegraph like being angry. That fucking, I don't know. It didn't really sound like I made a good point. I don't know. It was just really like sort of childish of me saying that crap. I don't know. It's just stupid. I think that was like a long time. I don't know, but yeah. If I was to like say it, if I was to like comment on the video now, I'd probably say it's really old, but if I had a good conscience, I'd probably say IGN is kind of chow, it's kind of fucking dumb for saying that. That, you know, Sonic is, you know, double down on Sonic, like it's just dumb. I don't know. Like, no one should really take IGN really serious, but I did for some odd stupid reason. And. I don't know. It's just that when they said Sonic is like, I don't know. They didn't say it, it through their own words, but when they said Sonic was garbage, I don't know. It just made no sense, really. Like, honestly, it proved that what they said was, li was obviously false because the amount of reviews they did for Sonic. They did give so Sonic certain good reviews. I mean, they gave Sonic Adventure DX a good review. They gave Sonic Adventure 2 a good review. So I don't know why they would literally create false lies saying Sonic was terrible. I mean, they literally said Sonic CD was good. I mean, yeah. So how could you literally, like, I don't know, change the subject and change how you feel about Sonic. You literally said Sonic was Sonic CD was good and all of a sudden you're now saying Sonic CD or Sonic is terrible altogether? No, one of them said Sonic CD was good and then they decided to change his uh, opinion all of a sudden because I guess he didn't want to be the one to get flanked on because he didn't agree with them. I mean... Don't have to agree on everything other people say, you know? Like, honestly, I, I'll say I like Sonic, all right? Sonic 06 was terrible. Everyone knows that, you know? I can't say my opinion on Sonic Forces because I never played it. I can say my opinion on Sonic Generations. It was actually good. It was actually kind of like a, you know, um, a cool homage to, like, the other Sonic games and having classic Sonic in it. So I like that. Yeah, the one thing I really did not like though is that they didn't bring uh, Rosie the Rascal in the game. That would have been awesome having a classic. No, having a classic t uh, Knuckles and Rosie. That would have been awesome. 
or classic Amy and Knuckles. That would have been awesome, bro. Like, that would have fit so much. I mean, they did get classic Tails, so why not? I mean, because classic Knuckles, he was in Sonic 3 and Knuckles. He was, you know, he was in Sonic 3 as well. He was in Sonic 3 and Knuckles. He was in Sonic and Knuckles, so I don't understand why they couldn't get a classic Knuckles. I don't know. Um, I'm just saying. Um, but yeah, Sonic Generations wasn't bad of a game, you know. You know, I have played Sonic 06, and I can say for certain that game is a pile of crap, dude. Like, I'm probably never gonna do an LP on that game because honestly, I don't even have like any software to really do that. Like, I don't even have like a uh, fucking certain recording to really record console games, but. I can tell you for a certainty that I hate that game. It pissed me off so much, I literally tore it apart. Like, not even, not saying that like in a threat, I literally tore that game apart. Like, legit tore it in half and threw it away. That's how much I hate that fucking game. Kind of regret it, because I kind of wanted to like, you know, play it through it again, just to go back into the shittiness that it is. Um, but yeah, that game was terrible. Another game I can tell is terrible, Crash, Crash Bandicoot, Rat the Cortex. That game was horrible. Another game, uh, t uh, Crash, Bite of Mutants, and Crash of the Titans. Another terrible game I can pretty much name out the top of my head. Uh, pff, I don't know. <laughs> I fucking died. But I don't know. Um, there's a lot of terrible games out there. It's probably hard for me to even fucking talk about. And I can't really say games that's already been known to be in terrible and I haven't played them. It basically me just, you know, be similar to IGN, you know. Agreeing with other people instead of having their own opinion about it. Either way, all I can say is that I don't know. Looking at the video that I post or looking at the old video where I play Sonic C D and then I decided to like talk about the IGN, made like a little, little rant about it, I don't know. I just felt that it wasn't me how I would like really do a video. I don't know. Cause it, I don't know. It just, I don't know. It's not something I would want to record. Like, you know, like I know a lot of people have different styles on how they record and everything, but I don't know. When I did that rant, I don't know. I felt like I was just doing everything that other people was doing already. And it wasn't like, you know, original. Yeah, I mean, because when I saw it, I wanted to literally, like, make a video of my own without having a fucking webcam on, which, because I didn't. <laughs> <clears throat> yeah, I don't, yeah, I don't do a webcam unless, like, I get, like, certain, you know. Unless I get certain subscribers, I don't want to do a webcam, because, you know, obvious. But, I don't know. I just really didn't want to, like do what I, I just didn't want to do like other people did, but I did it any damn way. And <laughs> I love that. <laughs> Fucking dust step. That's, 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 that's comical. I love it. But yeah. Um, yeah. Like I was saying, I just didn't want to basically do like everyone else what they did and basically like make the same damn thing. So I apologize if the IGN video, or the IGN rant, I don't know. Yeah, I just didn't really care for it. It just didn't feel like me, you know. I got embarrassed to what I said. Some of the things I actually agreed, but some of the things I, I don't know, I didn't agree on because it just didn't sound right, you know. But yeah, that's, I mean, I don't know. Oh, well. Um, nowadays can't really take IGN seriously with the amount of shit they did. I mean, going back into the Sonic review they did. Can you really take them seriously after they fucking did a Sonic Unleashed review twice? I mean, it's like they did like a back-ass word bullshit with that crap. Like, they decided 
They they decided to review Sonic Unleashed, two different versions of Sonic Unleashed, the PS3 slash Xbox 360 version and the Wii slash PS2 version. And they gotten someone who doesn't even know a lot about Sonic, doesn't even know about Sonic Unleashed, doesn't know about any other Sonic game, and can't really give a good honest opinion on it. Got someone, a shitty reviewer, to review the fucking game, made it a complete mockery of it, and literally just, I don't know. Can I say they're fucking garbage at it? Like honestly, literally died the amount of times that no one would. <laughs> I'm just saying. I'm pretty sure any competent player would know that. Honestly, I wouldn't even like die that many times or even purposely die to try and make a shitty point or trying to make another shitty reason on it. It's just dumb really. You know? Not to mention they also shit it on uh Sonic Lost World, which I don't know why, because Sonic Lost World isn't even that bad of a game. Like honestly. I had no problems with it. It's not that bad. You need to chill out about that game. Um I'm, no. They just reviewed Sonic Unleashed really badly. Not to mention, the funny part is they gave Sonic, uh, they gave the the PS2 slash 360 version, or no, not 360, the Wii version, like, a good review. Not gonna hate on them, because honestly, the guy who gave the review actually probably knew what he was talking about. No, the, the, the Xbox 360, the Xbox 360 and PS3 version. No, they gave that one a shitty review. I don't know why. It's just that IGN, <clears throat> their set patterns on good games are like just Mario, Call of Duty, and that's about it. Honestly, if anything, that's the only good reviews they probably give. You know, and honestly, I wouldn't even bother. I wouldn't even care if they didn't try and shit on Sonic purposely, but I don't know. I'm going on a weird tangent. I don't know why. Uh, I was just going through the game, just you know, playing it. But I kind of just I don't know. So I guess that's all I can really talk about. I can't really talk about anything else with the game. So I hope you guys enjoyed uh, this part. Thank you for watching. And, uh, yeah. For, uh, part two. Or, yeah, part two of this. We will be going through Rocky Road. Or, I think that's what it's called. Yeah. So, I'll see you guys next time. Take care. And have a wonderful day. Later.